our story so far. Having finally returned to Rainhold Manor with Claudia in tow, Layton and Luke are horrified to discover that a murder has been taken place there during their absence. Waiting for Luke and Layton at the manor in police detective Inspector Chalmay. Upon receiving a report on the murder, he has raced to St. Mister to conduct an investigation. He has his suspicions about Luke and Layton. Shortly after the murder, a servant in the Rahal family named Ramon goes missing. At Lady Dahlia's request, Luke and the professor set out to gather information on his whereabouts. Hey what's up guys, my name is Martin Ostrimo here, and with the longest time, I think welcome back to some more Let Professor Layton and the Curious Village. Last time, we're still on the continuation of finding Ramon. It says we're gonna talk to the guy named Crouton. What? <laughs> um, okay, I think we're gonna go this way. There's a park here. Here's so where. Ooh, let's go this way. Forward here. It looks like there's a. What's this? Rainhill Park open 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Can we go anywhere? The broom is broken. That's weird. Where's Crouton? This guy? Oh. That's Polly. Oh, I'm this time I'm just livid. It's just too much to take. Too much to take. The needle on my watt meter is completely buried. Why am I so worked up, you ask? It's this blasted puzzle. I've been trying to work it out since yesterday. I just can't get it. It has me no st so steamed I can't sleep. You stupid jerk of a puzzle. Come here and take a look, will you? Pill prescription. Oh, it's gonna be fun. A man has been described 10 pills. Starting today, he must take one pill a day, okay? But because the concentration of the medicine is different on each pill, he must take them in a specific order. Since the pills all look the same, the man has to write numbers on each pill. Do you remember, an, um, remember the order he needs to take them in? How many pills does he have to number if he wants to keep track of the order? Okay, here's the thing. He has 10. One pill a day, right? In a specific order? That doesn't make any sense. Like, how is that even possible? I don't know, I don't know this one. Um... Let's try. So, so one per day. I think I got this. So, meaning. There you go. This man has to start taking his pills in today. The first thing he should do is take his pill. Next, he should enable the pills 1 through 9. If he does this, he should be able to uh, do this. Oh, that makes sense. What were you thinking, man? And here I was ready to solve it all by myself. Why did you go and ruin everything? The nerve. But without pills to solve, I can sleep again. So I guess I owe you guys one. Thanks. I know you both have your work cut out for you, so good luck, yeah? Ooh, another gained gizmo. I want to check something real quick. Gizmos. Oh? It's coming along. Mysteries. What's this? 
Oh, it's just, um... Okay, crouton, I think. What's... I don't remember what's his face. Hee hee, thank you. Oh my gosh. Andrea, Andrea. I think it's this way. Is it because she doesn't understand what murder in a manner? A murder in our little village, that very hard gives me the goosebumps. And a great idea for our novel. Oh, excuse me intensively. I'm just ideas on uh, the up for new ideas. How can I help you? You're looking for Ramon. I've seen him around. I can see that I haven't seen him today. But if you search around town has turned him out, he's probably at the park or in the tower. You know, somewhere the villagers don't normally go. The tower, huh? Oh, you should stay as far from that tower as possible. There are all sorts of bad rumors about it. It sure seems that way. We just keep learning to people who say that. Just what are the rumors? Just, you know, bad stuff. There's something really scary about the tower. Tell me about it. Go this way. Uh, hey, girl. In here? Happy it doesn't open. I'm looking for into the mysteries. Are you? Need to take on the situation. Well, um, hmm. is nothing the matter? Ah, uh, yes. Now I remember. If it's rumors you're after, take a take a follow and go ask Crouton. He owns a, the restaurant in town. Oh, restaurant. I was like, where is this guy? It's not that, dude. No. Wait, where is, uh... I'm, I'm trying to find Crouton. This is... Is it this dude? Rodney. I hear you've been fil- I hear you've been stay away from that tower. That place brings misfortune upon the village. And I strongly advise you keep your distance. I am! Social distancing, right? Ronnie, Ronnie, Ronnie. He said restaurant, so I'm thinking of this guy. Was it him? There you go. Ramon. Hmm? He hasn't been around today. Ha. Huh. Looks like we've hit another dead end. Too bad you couldn't find him. He usually skips out of work and comes up here to gossip and have coffee. And you know, speaking of gossip, I've heard some weird rumors from my customers lately. Recently, there's been talk about some man, old man running around saying Mr. Kidnapping People. A kidnapper? Who is this old man? I heard all this second hand, so you got me there. You need to find a better source for village gossip. You might want to take your luck at the cafe. Usually you'll hear rumors straight from the source there. It's almost sense to announce the cafe should be open for dinner. The mysterious old man kidnapping villagers folk? Now that's a rumor. All right, we clear chapter three. Professor, it's getting dark out. I'm afraid that's my cue to start going shop. Come by tomorrow if you get hungry. Oop. Let's take a moment to sum up our findings. We have a strange roaring tower, disappearing villagers, and an odd elderly kidnapper. It's so bizarre, I can't make any sense of it at all, Professor. Oops. I think we finally got some clues on our hands, my boy. Observing the nightlife is this village what well, tells us more of what we need to know. Great idea, Professor. 
Chapter 4, Night Falls. It's returned dark, and Ramon still hasn't returned. Continue the investigation to find clues. Yes, please, save. Collect info into the cafe. Okay. This was Marco Way. Oh, it's blocked. Who's this guy? Gerard. Oh, goodness. Whatever shall I do? What seems to be the trouble, sir? Let's see here. Strong. Young. And you look like you have a good back. Oh, thank hangman's you came along. I beg your pardon? I've searched everywhere, and I just can't find the thing. Oh, I suppose I must dropped it when I was strolling by the park this afternoon. I would go searching for it myself, but it's gotten dark out. It is awfully scary out there. Bah, nothing of the sort. It's just that, well, I'm no spring chicken anymore, and my eyes aren't as sharp as they used to be. So how about it, Sunny? Will you help me go an old man and go search in part another park for me? What? But we're in the middle of investigation now. Now now Luke, no need to be rude. After all, the park is is about a small ways away. And who knows? We might actually find some new information to aid our case there. Besides, helping those in need is the duty of any gentleman. Splendid! I'll wait here, right here for you to come back. I'm counting on you. One more detail, please, sir. What exactly did you drop? Drop? I... Oh my, no. What was it? Um... Oh, that's right. It's my, it's my watch. Actually, my best Swiss watch. Bring it back for me, Sonny. Search the park. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Um, oh, frick, Andrea has a thing. I'm sorry, young lady, can you help us? We're looking for someone at UC and... Sorry, can't help you. And by can't, I mean I don't want to. I barely even talked to Ramon, and I'm so not interested in this search. <laughs> but if you help me solve this puzzle, I might just might, you know, remember something. Teehee. <laughs> just who do you think you are, young lady? Uh, puzzled aliens is the puzzle. From high in the sky, a pair of aliens observes humans be using a bizarre object. Perplexed. One alien turns to so to say and says, How strange, the earthling is opening a hole in the sheet of paper and marking it with a line to show the other earthlings where the hole is. I've never seen anything like it. What could these extra extra visitors be talking about? No, um, I'm trying to do... What's it called? Opening a hole in the sheet of paper marking with a Hawaiian is a hole. What the heck is this? Um, give me a sec. I can't figure it out. Alright, figure it out. Took me some time, but. Oh, that tool! Ah, oh, that looks that makes sense. What do you think about it? The any description of the compass is pretty much spot on. Interesting how widely the perception of a young artist can vary, isn't it? You know, I've heard that if you aren't wa careful walking around seeing mystery at night, you can run into trouble. I bet Ramon wasn't being careful. What exactly do you mean? Painting scrap. Huh. Okay, let's go in the park. Why are you... Deek. Hmm. Do I last something again? 
I think he's getting a little tired and slow. He's always dropping stuff. So why did he drop this time? Let me guess, was it a wristwatch? Hmm? Indeed, he did drop a wristwatch. Did you pick it up around here? Uh, yep. Well, actually no. Because Beatrice was actually the one who to find it. Thing is, it was already late when she found it, so she decided to hold on to it until morning. Go to the end, you can probably f ask her for it. So there you go. Now that I've got your attention, could you give me a hand and solve this here puzzle? Dark places give me the willies, but I wanted to solve this puzzle so bad, I came out here for help. The puzzle is all about stars, see? Maybe you can make sense of the thing, hmm? Of course, I'd be happy to help you with it. The biggest star. Legend has it that the people used to stare up at the heavens to f and find images of animals or important events in the constellations. Looking up at the star-filled sky here, try to connect the five largest objects in space to form the large point pointed star in possible. Connect stars by drawing a line between them. Make sure that your line doesn't pass through a line of star along the way. Okay. Is it gonna be those, uh... Wait, there's a limit? Oh, frick. Um... I actually don't know. Oh, I'm stupid. Hey, thanks a bunch. I can finally go home and catch a few winks. <sighs> oh yeah, now I remember. Beatrice from the inn was the one to find Gerard's watch. Don't ask, to, don't forget to ask her about it, okay? Okay, see you tomorrow. <sighs> Come, Luke, let's go. Alright. Ask about the yeah watch. The end. Where's the end again? Oh. Who's getting puzzle and bend this door? I could have sworn there was nothing there a minute ago. Fascinating. The puzzle appears to be acting as some sort of lock for this door. How delightful. Look, my boy. Why don't you give this a try? I'm almost certain the door will open if you solve it. Get the ball out. One. Can you get the ball, red ball out of the maze? Slide up structure blocks of the way to clear a path for the ball. This problem can be solved in, in as few as 12 moves. Okay. That's one. Two. Three. 
go four and eight nine ten eleven <sighs> wait twelve moves wait so boom boom I gotta clear out the path right Got it. Right. Oh, it does open. Who's this? Why, howdy. Do you often find yourself aching and painfully stuck on puzzles? Well then, Sonny, you come to the right place. Welcome to Granny's Wilton Puzzle Shack. Granny Willilton? Where can we find this lady? This is obviously she's right in front of you, boy. It's no wonder you have trouble solving puzzles. Yes, you are greatly at the beautiful and clairvoyant Granny Willilton. Guide you the puzzled puzzlers. Beautiful and clairvoyant? Professor, do you know what she's going on about? Fret not, Luke. Why don't you let me do the talking here? Her department to is written. But by clairvoyant, do you mean to you say that you have psychic powers? You can do things like uh, you pick a criminal out of a crowd or visualize the location of lost objects. Any fortune teller can do that. So what if you can see a few days into the future? Big whoop. My question you see is puzzles. Puzzles people forget about. Puzzles people miss. Sure you boys had a few of those, eh? No need to turn red. How to do the to the best of puzzlers. What I do, you see, is that I take those poor little puzzles and invite them to come stay with me. Wow, so those puzzles that we tried but weren't able to solve, those puzzles are here now? It looks like you finally f figured out what makes me so amazing. Now go ahead and give a knock on the door. I thought there was a shack behind me. It's like you'll find a rows of cute little jars, each of them for a forgotten puzzle. I bet you find those lost puzzles. Of yours somewhere in the midst of all my little pretties. Well then, I will get back to that another time. But first, let's go. Oh, there's no way we can show our faces in the manner until we find some sort of clue. We must continue to investigate. I couldn't agree more, Professor. Hello there, boys. Two name for the night already? Not quite. I've heard word that you found a wristwatch out by the entrance to the park. All that old thing doesn't belong to you, Professor? Oh no, it's Gerard. He dropped it today while wandering around town and asked me to help him find it. Well, I'm not surprised. That man sheds more stuff than a cat seen by a fireplace. Alright then, here's that watch. You know, it figures out it belongs to Gerard. I just think to myself, the professor is, is far too fashionable to wear this old thing. <laughs> Thank you very much. Gotta wear a swatch. Oh yes, and just out of curiosity, you haven't seen Ramon about it lately, have you? Ramon? That skinny man with the pur big purple lips? No, he hasn't come by today. But you know, for all his fancy clothing, I hear he's actually quite the layabout. He's so probably out idly at the cafe. Why don't you go check him for him there? I see. If that's the case, I'd like to go to the cafe right away. Do you mind keeping the front door open a little longer? Oh, don't worry, Professor. Another guest arrived to stay the night. I can stay out of his room. Besides, my door is always open for a dash and gentleman to search yourself. 
Talk to Gerard, okay. There he is. Oh, so you found my watch, did you? But of course, a gentleman always helps those in distress. Speaking of which, we're still quite well worried about Ramon's whereabouts and search probably should probably return our search now. Yep, seeing mysterious strange like that, despite its size, it can be quite challenging to find people. Sometimes it feels like running in a darn maze. Be amazed, you ever heard of this one, Sunny? But we really must be on the run. A mysterious bandit on the lamb, trying to escape the police who are hot on his trail. His entrance to this part of town is marked with an arrow. This particular bandit provides a particular creed and has vowed never to go backward or turn around. Additionally, where, wherever he meets an entrance, he always, always turns left or right. Now, you can see them. Excuse me from the map. This part is, which are here, A through G. All, all the exits, which one will I be able to pass through? Go through town here. Oh, left or right? I will be never be able to. Oh, never. Okay. Uh, boom, 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 boom. No. Um. Um. Cause like, I turn around, dude. Eh? Yeah, that would make sense. You're a sharp one, Sunny. You know, if you're looking for someone, you should ask around at the end of the cafe. As you know, the inn is right by the entrance to the village. Yeah, the cafe is right at the fork in the road just north of there. We've already searched it, but checking the cafe show is a scary deal. We'll sure to stop by. Well, I'm off to bed. An old man needs his beauty rest. Thanks again for your help. Think that's good, sir. Cream rug. See you later. Okay. Anyways, I'll end it here. Let's see me. Let's see me a long night. Get it? Because we're nighttime. Next time on Professor Layton and the Curious Village, we're gonna go. Uh, Carry venture at night time and see what the cafe has to offer and see what happens. You guys search for watching, feel free to like if you like this like so far and, for, and subscribe to new to stay up to what you see with the channel. And uh thank you guys for watching. See you all. Martin also is train right while we're here. Sign out. Home the guys, stay awesome, take care.